All right, today we are going to be going over the installation of speaker pods onto the 1990 to 1994 Chevy Silverado GMC Sierra. If you got this door panel that can hold a boomerang, you're in luck. So for this vehicle, we introduced the dual six and a half for the door. Also a dual two inch tweeter mounts up on the door as well. So now you can have dual six, dual two. Let's get uh, started on the installation. All right, so for this installation, we're gonna need the same basic tools. You need a Dremel with a sanding drum and a roto zip bit. Uh, but this one's gonna be a little bit more challenging because it's got the carpet. So when we go to cut it with the Dremel, what's gonna happen is the carpet's gonna get gum gumped up in the bits. So we're gonna go ahead and try it with the Dremel, see what happens. Let's get started on it. So starting with the doors, first thing to do is to test fit, as always. Test fit the pod, make sure that it fits the way you want, make sure there aren't any clearance issues. After that, we're going to go ahead and drill with a 3 16 inch drill bit. We're going to go ahead and drill and put hardware into the door. So we're going to get the pod in place where we want it, drill our first hole. Once that hole is drilled, take some of the hardware, get one of the short screws, and put it in the hole to hold the position. Put that one in place, holding down the pod, get a nice little tension on it. We're gonna go ahead and keep going across the top. so we can actually cut. Okay, in there like so. Same thing. I'm gonna start around the front. Make sure you hang the door off the table a little bit so you get a good angle with your drill. Make sure there's no carpet. Drill bit. Next step is to cut the door panel, make room for the speakers. Since we got in so much trouble with this carpet while drilling holes, I believe cutting out is going to be a lot more difficult. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna mark, we're gonna actually cut the carpet off, but I wanna leave the carpet behind the flange because that's the way the pod was designed. So, get our permanent marker. I got a silver one for some reason. Let's just kind of mark out where we wanna cut. Exacto knife very carefully. Let's cut this carpet away. Exposed plastic, we will use roto zip bit.
Come back with our sanding drum. Now for these bottom two screws, we want to drill as perpendicular to the surface of the pot as possible because we don't want to go through the pocket. We want to come out up underneath, going in between this piece. So we're going to screw, sandwich everything like that. Same thing on this one. So, if we keep it upside down, that might actually help there. So we're going to drill through the carpet again and pop up right there. So that pop up right there. Same thing on this one. Let's pull that carpet back. tool will work. Dry that up. Get the screw in there. Right in there. And you can see the end of it. And then magically put a nut. Remember, when tightening these bolts and screws, not too much. Just because this carpet and stuff is here does not mean you need to crank it down and make the metal parts of the bolt touch together. Just want to get it snug to hold the pod in place. That may mean that the screw and nut can rotate a little bit. That's okay. Now 
you're ready to install your speakers, which we can do in another video. But for now, dual six and a halves for your 1990 to 1994 Chevy Silverado GMC Sierra or Chevy CK truck, 1500 I think is the only one that works on. Um, but anything that'll stow your boomerang, you'll be good. All right, peace.